All Aboard, bringing you board games, tonight on All Aboard. In Codenames Duet, we are working together to find our agents out in the field. We will give one word clues to point to multiple words on the table and contact the agents while trying to avoid a band of enemy assassins. Our time is limited as we try to find all the agents before it's too late. Hi guys, my name is Gly. And I'm Pat, you're very welcome to All Aboard. So we have the words set out here on the table and they're laid out in five rows of five and then here we have a map and this map is going to tell us where the agents that we need to contact are. So we will give each other clues and the clues can only be one word and a number after that and the number will say how many words we're trying to tie together with that with that clue. So there are three assassins on each side of the of the map and if we hit one of those assassins so if somebody says the word or points at the card that is one of the assassins we lose automatically. Otherwise if we get a wrong answer then the other person gets their go and we put one of these innocent bystander tokens down on the map. After that then if we get the answer correct we can guess again and actually we can guess as many times as we want but after we're finished guessing we take one of these tokens it's actually the same one but on the other side it's a time token and if we're scoring at the end yes. of the game then each of these time tokens is worth one point to us and any time tokens left in the bank at the end of the game and there's nine of them any of them are worth three points yes right? we need to make sure that we get all of them mm. <laughs> yeah yeah we'll try to get the best score we can well we'll try to beat it first <laughs> right? yeah. yeah true true the clues you give must be related to the meaning of the word so you can't for example give a word that rhymes like uh you know tip you can't say pip to mean yeah. it uh, it must be something that's related to the meaning and you can't say words that are in here. So, for example, this one here is... Uh, let me see if I can come up with a good example. <laughs> for example, I can't say boathouse for, you know, the, yeah. the house because house is already out here. So I can't use a clue like that. So right, let's the thinking begin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the first person to give a clue is the first person to think of one. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'll have to concentrate now. Yeah, so the first thing that we really want to do is we want to kind of look and see where the assassins are and yeah. then try not to give any clues that are going to be related to the assassin. Sure. The maps aren't the same on both sides, so what might be an assassin on my side could actually be an agent on Bly's side. Mm -hmm. And we have 15 of these agents that we're trying to get out on the board. So mm -hmm. there will be some overlap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Let's find them. I don't want any agent left out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. All right. Okay, late two. Late two, okay. Okay, well, it is involved with time, so minute is one option that I'm thinking of here. Late. Okay, okay, minute is one, I would say. There's one of our agents. Okay, another one for late. Take a break if you're going to be late, but it's a bit too abstract for me. You know what, I'm going to stick with one for now. I'm going to take my time clue, but I'll remember that I still have another late. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll just leave that there for now. Okay, I think I have one. Mm -hmm. um, okay. I just don't want to give you a, an assassin. <laughs> Fight four. Fight four. Hmm. That's a lot of fighting, huh? Uh mm huh. -hmm. Hit, I would say. Okay. Fight with a hit. Gonna fight with zombies. <laughs> You fight zombie. Okay. Delta can be called for Delta team for militaries. And you fight. When you fight, you sweat, you know? Because <laughs> you're kind of nervous. Ah, hmm. But I will first go with sword. 
Okay. Uh, one more. <laughs> one more fight. I think when you fight, I just want to keep it like that, but when you fight, you sweat for sure. Scratch. But when you fight, you can get a scratch too. You can break a leg when you fight. <laughs> You can throw some stuff in the window when you fight, so... Mm. Yeah, I'll take my token for now, but I'll keep that in my mind that I have <laughs> one more. Okay, well, we got three anyway. Okay. Mm -hmm. String two. String two, okay. Yeah, so that's S-T-R-I-N-G. <laughs> okay. String two. Okay, well, the only one that's jumping out of me straight away is Nylon. So I'm going to go with Nylon. Yeah, that's where one of our agents are. <laughs> okay, and now string. Sweat, scratch, butterfly, big leg, tip, rubber, manicure, flood, house. Okay, so the first one was late, and the second one is string. I kind of want to go for rubber, but I'm not completely sold on it. But rubber string, oh, that's also okay. <laughs> no, and it's just I don't know why it sounds right, you know. Manicure, you don't manicure with a string, right? Manicure is when you get your nails done, right? And you don't do your nails with a string, I guess. Tip. Fall break, break string. From Delta Curry, cone driver. The driver could be late. I'm going to go driver here. I think uh -huh. that's from late. <laughs> that's one of our agents. Okay, excellent. I'm going to take a token for now because I'm happy with getting <laughs> two. <laughs> But I know that there's a string out there still, or unless the driver was a string, or it could have been a completely different one, a string and late. I'm could be out there. Yeah, you can't say. This is my poker face. It's very good. It's very good. I'm completely sold. Completely <laughs> sold. Okay. Noise two. Noise two. Noise. Noise. Scratch can be noisy, like, you know. But first, I think Big Bang is a <laughs> bang. Okay. <laughs> this guy looks like Matthew McConaughey. Yeah. Okay. It's less of a theory to me. It's more of a, like a big bang. There you go. Noise, too. If somebody break in, there's noise. But I think Scratch, you can say that. I want to go for a scratch. I think scratch can be kind of like one of your um, fight earlier. I'm not hundred percent sure, but I'll go with it. Go for it. Scratch. Scratch is not ah, one of them. No. Ah, ah. Okay, so that's so an innocent bystander. Yeah, I was. I was. Okay. Fortunately, that wasn't it. So the hard time now is mine to think of how to put all these random words together. And yeah, that's right. I should have read a book before this game, so at least <laughs> I can get, get I can add more vocabularies. Yeah. <laughs> oh, huh. Oh. Fine. Mm -hmm. So we have how many guys left to go? Seven more to go. Seven more to go. Huh? Okay. Yeah. Mm hmm. Seven more to go. Seven agents still, huh? Yeah. Thinking of something, but it's kind of scary when you have a word in your head and there's just like other things that are on the edge that <laughs> yeah. can be. You need to be very careful not to give an assassin and exactly. even still like the yeah. innocent bystander is kind of a waste of a point. Mm -hmm. Working too. Working. I guess that a lumberjack is a job, so that's one. 
and now when you're working you do take a break let's see if there's anything else that sounds when well, you do sweat when you're working I guess manicure you could go for a manicure which is a job um, you get a tip when you're working <laughs> Uh, window, beard, house, blood, cone. It's not easy to stay silent, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Especially when, uh, you know, somebody's voicing their thoughts, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go for a break. Uh, uh, innocent bystander. Uh, okay. Innocent bystander. Hmm. We have two innocent bystanders now. Yeah. Well, at least we still have some clues to, to keep us going as well from before, right? Yeah. Mm. Working. That's now your go. Finger two. Finger two. So I'll go for a manicure. Okay. Finger tip. I think that's the best there. Window, you can like bird house. Mm. Just too obvious. Fingertip. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the other previous is fighting. Sweat could be fighting now. So fighting and noise. Break a window. God. Apron, Delta, Curry, Gone, John, Fark, Flood, House. If you open the window, you can hear the noise. But that's if you open the window. If the window <laughs> is closed, there's no noise. <laughs> Break could be noise. Sweat is fighting can be sweat, I think. Just scared to... No, I will get my Let's score. Take, your point. Yeah, okay. take my point. I'm not hundred percent sure, so I'm gonna take my chance. Okay. So it's it is my go now. Yep. Ventilation two. Ventilation. Okay. Well, window for sure. Mm -hmm. And I wonder now. Ventilation. You don't get ventilation on a floor, so maybe you were trying to avoid floor, and that's why you didn't say room and house is what you want to go for. But let me have another look. Butterfly, scratch, no sweat. Mm, you want ventilation to cool you down. A bit abstract. Rubber, floor, no. Break is not. It's gone. Uh, flood isn't ventilation for sure. Beard isn't. Cone, no. Jonah of Arc, no. April, no Delta Cray. I'm going to go with Hass. Assassin. Oh no. That was so good. You sweat, you need ventilation. It was no, so we were doing good. so well. We nearly we, we should have had it, you know? Like I had break, apron and rubber left to go. I have rubber and sweat. Okay. So rubber is one of my strings. Rubber oh, string. Yeah, that that that, that would work. I had rubber as well. Ah, oh, that was so <laughs> good. That was very disappointing. It's very difficult to tie words together in Codenames Duet, and when Gly got three words from my first clue, I thought we were off to a really good start. Codenames Duet requires a lot of thinking and concentration. Tying together random words is not easy. I think a good vocabulary is a must. When Gly gave late as a clue, I got minute immediately. I didn't connect driver straight away, but when I spotted it afterwards, I realized it was a really good clue. You should always remember the clues that you didn't get all the answers for, as they can help you find agents on subsequent turns. When Pat said, fight for, I was like, whoa, if I was able to get all those words, that's a very good head start for us. In this game, being able to tie four words together is very rare, so that was a really good clue. Getting a little bit more abstract to connect more words is superb here. The first thing I always do when playing Codenames Duet is look for the words that have an assassin. Then when I'm giving clues, I make sure that the words can't be connected to the assassin words in any way. 
Code names can be very unpredictable. Much of the time you find all your agents, but sometimes you don't, just like today. We'll find them all on another mission. So that's it for today. You have been watching All Aboard. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for staying with us and we'll see you again on our next video. Thanks a lot for watching. See you next time. Bye. Bye.